Hello, my name is Gail Wilhite. You, uh, right now near Panama City, Florida. If you want to find anything about me, go to MySpace, Facebook, or Twitter, uh, where I have accounts. This year is a method directed primarily at the women of the world. Uh, although my, the, peop, the women I'm basically trying to get this message to are here in America, Canada, and Europe, but also in uh, other countries of the world. And it's a message that will save your life if you listen to me very carefully. I'll try not to talk too fast. Uh, because what I'm about to say can mean the difference between life and death. Simply put, it is true that a woman can be murdered simply for having sex outside of marriage. And sometimes within marriage. It comes down to simply this. When a woman's going to have sex with a guy, there's a question that she needs to ask this guy. Are you pro-life? Or are you pro-choice? If he says he's pro-choice, but you're pro-life, and you get pregnant by him, and refuse to have an abortion, he may murder you so that he doesn't have to pay child support. It's as simple as that. The reason why I'm mentioning this, and I've mentioned this in another video, and uh, that video has, uh, so far almost has, in the, the hits are in the thousands now. Apparently it's, uh, uh, it's hit a nerve with a lot of people. Uh, but in that video, I'll, you know, basically I mentioned that there are guys out there who will kill a woman that they've impregnated so they don't have to pay her child support. And the experts around the world and here in America and all these stupid talk shows, they seem to ignore that fact when they talk about things like this. They don't mention to you that having sex outside of marriage can result in your uh, death or you being murdered. They sometimes speak about it, but not in a direct way. They kind of just kind of circumvent around that, that uh, subject. They won't be very direct. I'm being very direct here. Simply put, it can result in your death. Homicide for pregnant women is the number one killer. More, you know, uh, pregnant women, more pregnant women die from being murdered. Who's the murderer? Usually the guy that impregnated them or somebody they hired to kill her. And there's no telling how many pregnant women have died in accidents that were actually, that was actually a murder. And it's been going on for 6,000 years probably. So, just having sex outside of marriage is more than just the act of getting pregnant or catching a sexual disease. It can also result in murder. So you see, it isn't as simple as you think it is. Uh, or as innocent as you think it is. And the same thing can apply to a married woman who marries a pro-choice man. She gets pregnant before he's ready, or just for the, or maybe he just doesn't want any children. She refuses to have an abortion, and he kills her. So it's simply this. When you're dating a guy, if you're pro-life, I would ask him, is he pro-choice? And I would uh, test him quite a bit to see if he's really pro-choice. I mean, uh, uh, pro-choice or not, because if you get pregnant by him and you don't have an abortion upon his assistance, he may kill you. And your life is over for all eternity, simply because you didn't ask that question. And just simply a yes or no is not good enough. You have to find out very carefully and kind of dig into it a little bit and find out if he's really pro-choice or pro-life. Now, if you're pro-choice and he's pro-choice, then it's probably going to be no problem if you get pregnant, if, you, if abortion is something you believe in. But me, I'm pro-life. Let me just make that very clear. But I don't care if you're pro-choice or pro-life. I'm trying to save uh, as many lives as I can here. Even women who are pro-choice, I still want to save your life. I don't. I, I look at life of anybody, whether I agree with them politically or not, as being very precious. So I'm just simply saying to the women of this world or to those who see this video, you date some guy, if you're going to have sex with him, ask him if he pro-choice or pro-life. Find out. That includes someone you're going to marry. And don't just ask it once. You need to really uh, press it from time to time. Not at one time, from, but from time to time. Uh, that's why having one-night stands can also get you murdered. It's not as innocent as you think it is. And it's not just about getting a sexual disease or just pregnant alone, and that's it. It's about saving your life. And it can cost you your life if you don't make these inquiries. So think about it. Thank you for your time, and I hope this saves somebody's life. I really do. I did make another video, and it did get a lot of responses, 
I hope that any woman that sees this will take this seriously. And if you're a parent, talk to your daughter about this and explain to her that uh, having sex outside of marriage, uh, again, even within marriage, could cost her her life. If you love your daughter, you need to talk to her. And you need to add this into your little sex education uh, when you tell her about the birds and the bees. You need to add this in. Thank you for your time.